Hi, I'm Dr. May Seibel, editor of My Menopause Magazine. I've just returned from Dallas, Texas and the annual meeting of the North American Menopause Society and I want to share with you an interview with Dr. Stephen Goldstein about a new medicine that's an alternative to estrogen for vaginal dryness. I know you're going to find it helpful. So let me begin by uh, asking you to state your name. Well, I'm Stephen Goldstein. I'm an obstetrician gynecologist uh, at NYU School of Medicine, uh, professor there. I am the director of gynecologic ultrasound, the co-director of bone density, and I'm the past president of the North American Menopause Society, and we're sitting here today at the North American Menopause Society meeting. Dr. Goldstein is one of the leading experts in menopause in the country, maybe beyond the country, in the world, and certainly in the area of ultrasound. He is one of the top people anywhere. And today he was talking about it, one of three new drugs that's become available that's not an estrogen, but there to help women in menopause. And the name of this new medicine is? Osfina. Mm -hmm. uh, Osfemifene is the, 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 the uh, drug name. Uh, it's a very exciting idea because it's uh, a new version of an old category of drug. This category of drug is called CIRM, Selective Estrogen Receptor Modulator. I know that sounds like a handful, but it means these are drugs that can act like estrogen in some tissues and be estrogen blockers in other tissues. And there have been some other CIRMs before that you may have heard of, tamoxifen that treats breast cancer, Evista that's for osteoporosis and preventing breast cancer, but they don't have any benefit in the vagina. This drug, Osfina, interestingly enough, acts like estrogen in the vagina without having estrogen-like effects in many of the other tissues where you don't want it. So what happens is, you, you were talking earlier about the fact that there were three things that this was able to accomplish for women. And you, well, so in order to get approved, you have to show that you, uh, you uh, reverse the changes of menopause in terms of the pH, the acid-base balance in the vagina becomes back to normal. The cell count uh, called the maturation index comes back to normal. And women's most bothersome symptom, in this case painful intercourse, uh, is significantly improved. But what's exciting about this is that this is the first non-estrogen, first oral agent to treat vaginal atrophy, vaginal dryness, and the painful intercourse that it causes in menopause. And this is groundbreaking because until now, virtually every patient in my practice either had to be on generalized estrogen therapy, either a pill or a patch that got to every organ in her body, which most people don't want, especially if her only complaint is painful intercourse, or increasingly, women were taking uh, inserts into the vagina, either creams or tablets or rings that stay in the vagina that deliver estrogen just to the vagina. But sometimes women don't want to put something in the vagina or other women don't want to be on any kind of an estrogen, even a low dose in the vagina, uh, whether their fears are founded or not. Uh, other women who can't take estrogen, uh, let's say they've had breast cancer and their doctor won't let them. And so to have now a new agent that's non-estrogen and oral uh, is really something new in women's health uh, and pretty exciting. And you said uh, it, it's oral once a day and how long does it take before a woman can see a benefit? That's a great point. I think because people take a pill they expect they're going to see a change almost immediately. Uh, most agents, even the estrogens in the vagina, can take up to 12 weeks. This particular drug showed statistically significant, that I know that's a medical term, at four weeks, a significant improvement, although I often tell my patients it may take the full 12 weeks before you're gonna get as good as you're gonna get, but you will start to notice improvement, which should be obvious by four weeks of using this medication. Thank you very much. You're welcome.